so okay in this session we'll be discussing about the module per program project 2 uh, which is actually you know updation of data data into the database tables for that what exactly we do is we first pick a database table which we already have now, we created a couple of uh, z tables so the, in that z tables we'll select one table which we have to update through screens so our logic here would be now here we have some employee details and our logic would be to enter these data through the screens instead of entering the data from normally all the all the you know standard programs will be of type display and maintenance allowed with restrictions when we have this option and when we activate this So once we have this and we go for utilities table contents we can we cannot create the data directly so what do we have to do is we have to on all the database tables standard database tables will be of the same type so for that what we had to do is we have to build a program to update the data through screens or uh, our module pool programming so i'll take some zjhs underscore emp99 and create employee data updation and here I'll take it as module pool programming because it's a module pool and then click on local object once we have this uh, we have to create this ZJH softtech EMP is what we'll create here tables ZJH softtech underscore EMP is what we have to create and then we need to create a work area internal table is not exactly required in this particular scenario that we are doing right now so it underscore emp type zjh of tech emp and then save it activate it come back back out of it then open sc51 transaction code to create the screens so in the screens we need to give the exact name of the program that's jh of tech And then here we need to give 100 you can give any number so program update update what update data. EMP data something like that now here we'll just save it and click on the look layout in the layout uh, we'll just go for this and uh, text and this J soft tech employee data we need to give it in the text See here I'll take this text one just employee data save it and now we need to select this one the dictionary program fields windows select that click on get from program in the get from program did I say it it underscore w underscore I need to change it as work area right that means it's only taking one just value yeah one value at a time now let's do it again Now here, save it. Main program. Now this again we have to go with. Uh, save it. Again back. Double click on this. Yes sell this program main program control f2 control f3 once it's been done what we have to do is we have to go ahead with the okay this has been done so once these two things are done we have to come back and uh, 
you know activate this once you activate this once you activate this particular uh, program so what did we do is in the layout select this one and now it should reflect this actually uh, we have changed it to work area right this will come out of it and uh, log in again layout get from program this work area what all the fields that we have for work area select this and say ok ok text text to employee number then we have what we have is employee name email so employee name text 3 employee name and what is this field about email so I'll give here text 3 text 4 email text 5 phone save it activate once you activate it uh, once you activate this and uh, then you can you have to come back to our program so in the program what we have to do is we have to here we have to say okay we need we also need to create some ch in uh, I mean like input push buttons so in this we'll create push buttons pb1 pb1 as per save and the FCT code that we have here is SAV save so here what we have to do is we have to go for refresh and in the refresh we go for PB2 and uh, in this refresh and here we'll go for PB PB2 or say REF refresh save it and then we have PB3 exit and FCT code for this is EXT save and uh, activate this flow logic and then when we have this so here when we say case sy you com in case when uh, we have uh, when when save sav insert into it underscore uh, in, into the table name this okay, database table name values w underscore emp when uh, ref uh, clear clear w underscore emp when 
ext leave program leave program so once it's been done so we also have the program active and uh, the module pool is also active okay you have to make sure that this is active so once the program as well as the module pool both are active we need to create a transaction code for this sc93 and let's say c98 create say ok and in this we'll create the program name the program name is hhs underscore 99 is this the one yes, yes. so now the the screen number is okay. yeah save in the local object and now let's go for zhs 99 and zhs 98 now employee name can you tell me some employee name Bruce Lee. Oh, sorry. Employee name is Bruce Lee. Employee number is five. Email address. Sorry. Bruce Lee at the red shirts of tech dot com. Phone number. Click on save. Once it's been saved okay you can also have a pop-up saying that you know it's successfully saved when you click on refresh it it goes away okay so when you go for exit you can you can have multiple values like you know now we can go for jackie chain we have two records here uh, now let's go back to sc11 and check the updation of this data in this in this table so now we'll go for the contents and in the contents we need just need to see this data you have bruce lee and jackie details have been updated here into the uh, into the standard data or, or the customized database table the same way we can also uh, you know load the data into the standard database tables as well this completes a project in which we are actually updating the data into the database table through the sap bi screen uh, i mean like module pool screens okay yes we can change it in standard data standard database tables also can update the same thing in standard database also so let's say uh, by default you ha you want every time some values to come now you want it to be saved as uh, a variant then you just need to say control s Okay, so we can do that. 